D. It was actually crazy how I met him because I was actually shooting on my block that day. We were a couple of my bros or whatever, out there taking pictures, you know, having fun. And he walked up to me. Never seen this guy anywhere in my life before. But he explained the situation like he's moved from Harlem back to the BX, you know, with fam. And basically, um, he started pushing a couple of dope ideas to me. You know, photo shoots, fashion shows, all that good stuff that I love, you know. So I was really feeling what he was saying. So I'm like, you know what? I straight ran with it. Like, after that day, it was a straight dope life. Dashing photography. Well, dashing photography actually started because me and my boy, we had shared the same passion, you know, like fashion photography, like that. So, we, we just, you know, we got, a little, we got a little cameras, you know, Canon. And we started like going around, you know, downtown, doing little photo shoots there. And we was, we was actually really dope with the work or whatever. You know, and we was actually, we was young. So he was like, yo, let's just keep doing this or whatever, whatever. But he actually laid off of it. but. I'm like, in my head, I'm like, yo, I can really do something with this, like, you know, dashing photography. So I can go far with it. So I actually sat down with my boy HD, pitched the idea to him. He loved it. it was, he said it was sick, that name dashing photography. We started actually doing Fashion Week every year since for about three years now. And it was one of the dopest things I have ever done, honestly, because to, to put me in that type of environment that I was in, it was crazy. I've seen models that I've been looking up to since I was younger, photographers that I just found out about with sick work, and all that. So me and my boy HD was in there. We were actually we were actually the um, only black media press. The rest of them were like, you know, like Caucasian or whatever. So it was I'm like, I have to kill it. We have to kill it. Our footage has to be crispy, it has to be sick. Um we did a bunch of shows, Style 360, Front Row, um, Sammy B, Mara Hoffman. Yeah, I actually remember going to um, Samantha um, Black's fashion show. Her pieces were so dope. Like, I, I really enjoyed that fashion show because um, just to find out she was a young and upcoming designer at that time, and now she's doing big things like Project Runway, her lines all over the world, stuff like that. That's really dope to see. And like, I'm proud to say that I was there to like, you know, to take to photograph her come up. So after we wrapped up Fashion Week, whatever, um, I'm like, yo, I have to get into music, you know, artists, you know, photography, stuff like that. We, I actually started taking pictures of a whole bunch of artists, you know, going to press dates, listening parties, you know, just, you know, just following what the trend was, you know. The dopest shot of celebrity I actually got was um, Rosé at, um, at his girlfriend's fashion show, um, Front Row. Like, I seen the big puff of smoke in the back. I'm like, oh, I know it was Rosé coming through. So I rushed over there and got the perfect shot, you know? That was, one of, that was the dopest shot I ever got, a rosé. What inspires me as far as fashion, definitely, art, photography, anything that has colors, anything that's dope, like anything that has meaning to it, you know? Because um, from, from when I was smaller, um, I actually um, used to draw a lot. Draw like, you know, in class, we used to mess around, do little doodles or whatever. But like, as far as going, that's why I want like dash photography to maybe even like start an art school, you know, teach kids how to um, draw, teach kids, you know, just be they, be they self, like do what you want to, like do what you feel to do, like, and fashion, and another thing, like I see, I see fashion, fashion is everywhere you go, like no matter if it's high fashion, low fashion, it's, it's whatever your whatever you feel to put on, whatever you feel that looks good on you, that's, that's who you are, like, that, that's fashion. Where do I want dash photography to go as far as I want it to be as big as possible, like, and even, even when it's as big as possible, I want it to go way further than that, like, branch off maybe into a museum, uh, a school teaching art, because I feel as if um, art, I feel as if photography is, is definitely a, a form of art, you know, shapes, colors, Photoshop, you know, editing, you know, stuff like that, because um, I'm, I'm actually a very visual person, so um, 
like I don't see like I probably won't I'd rather see a, a color more fast than I would see like a number or digits or something like that so maybe that's why I was so bad at math but yeah um but yeah as far as dashing photography I want it to be as huge as possible like I want everyone to know about it I don't only do celebrity I don't only do celebrity stuff definitely not um I'm I want to do like upcoming models, upcoming actresses, actors, artists, anyone that's willing to work with me. I look up to people as far as Kanye, Pharrell, um, Will Smith, um, Denzel, um, all those, you know, any, anybody that, like, that has ambition, because um, ambition is one of the most dopest things a person can have. Like, you can, you can have your looks, you can have your body, you can have anything, but ambition, if you have ambition, I swear you're going to go far as hell with that. Hey.